Today we're going to talk about the closest subdivision to this rail trail, Calview Subdivision, and we're starting now. Hi, I'm Lisa Salt from Remax Vernon Salt Valor, and we're going to take a tour through the Calview subdivision today. We're going to look at the proximity to the rail trail, to the college, to the beach. We're going to look at some old homes. We're going to look at some new homes. We're going to look at some multifamily homes. But before we do, please make sure you subscribe to our channel because we're posting new videos every single week. So Calview Estates is a medium-sized subdivision within the municipality of Coldstream and it's bordered by Highway 97 at the top en route to Kelowna, Kalamalka Lake on the downside, and then this new part over here that I, I don't officially know that it's part of Calview Estates, but we're going to call it that it is because it overlooks Kalamalka Lake. But it goes over towards Cal Beach and then on the other side there's not really anything. It's really well situated to get on the highway and off to Kelowna. And it cuts your time down to the Kelowna International Airport to 27 minutes, which is kind of nice, especially if you're commuting to Kelowna every day for work. And yet you're still only eight minutes to downtown Vernon. Now the number one reason to live in Cal View would be just that, the Cal View, Kalamalka Lake Views. The views for the part of Calview that's below the highway go right over the lake and through to the Monashi Mountains in many locations. And the great part is you get the awesome lake views, plus you get the coveted exposure of the morning sun and then you lose that beating late afternoon summer sun that can tend to kind of fry people up in Middleton Mountain. Another reason people like buying in Calview is its location close to the rail trail. Now the rail trail is a collaboration between Lake Country, the City of Kelowna, the Okanagan Indian Band, and the North Okanagan Regional District. And it was an old CN rail line from 1925 that was used to transport produce and lumber from the Okanagan across the country. And now it's a walking, running, and biking trail all along Kalamalka Lake. And it's right in front of Calview subdivision for super duper easy access. One of the great parts about the trail is how flat it is so people from all ages can walk or bike the trail with like no issues. There's over 24 kilometers of trail that follows lake shore and the creek so the scenery and the wildlife is awesome. There's another small park in the subdivision aptly named Calview Park and it's a nice little park that has some green space, tennis courts and a playground. There are no elementary or secondary schools in the Calview subdivision. Kids would get bussed. However, you're very close to the Vernon campus of Okanagan College, where there's around 16,000 students that are attending each year. And right by that campus is the relatively new 2015 built Greater Vernon Athletics Park that has track and field facilities, throw and jump areas, and it's free for the general public or groups can pay a fee to book the facility for their exclusive use if they want. Really is a beautiful facility with a synthetic sports field with a 400 meter running track around it. So it's very close within walking distance just up the hill from Calview. You're also still close to Cal Beach, which is probably the best known beach in the North Okanagan. I mean, from Calview, you could easily walk down West Cal Road and get to the beach, or you can park across from the beach in the parking lot. That beach is super popular. It has a 300 meters of beach with soft sand and shade from the trees, picnic tables, concession. It has a south facing view that looks right down the center of the lake towards Kelowna. Plus, it also has the famous Kalamalka Lake Rotary Pier, which is a popular spot for fishing and sunbathing and swimming. And there's also quite a few amenities around the beach itself as well. There's the Kalamalka Lake General Store, the beach rental place for paddleboard rentals, and the east end of the beach, there's Alexander's Beach Pub, with its famous patio overlooking the lake and the beach plus their wine and beer store, which is also within stumbling distance. And not too far from here is the Cala Vista boat launch as well for boat launching and summer entertainment purposes. Now coming back closer to Calview Estates, let's look at some of the housing options here. There's quite an assortment of older established homes with mature landscaping built in the kind of late 60s, 70s, 80s. Plus, as you get up to the top on the one side, there was an extension to the subdivision punched through in the 90s. And there are those homes available as well. Some are quite close to the highway and some have some really great views. 
Then since Y2K, there have been many newer homes and some brand new homes as well, up top and down at the bottom with some absolutely killer views. Some have been carved out of the hillside and have innovative designs, usually with elevators. And then on the downside, the coveted level entry walkout floor plan. Down on Greystone, you'll find the unobstructed view homes right over the rail trail looking down the lake. But be prepared to open your checkbook for these ones. Then in the newly developed area that I guess isn't technically in Calview Estates, but we would term it Calview, there are some nice new homes up here. These aren't the massive homes. They're more mid-sized and mid-priced. Plus there's also an assortment of duplexes that have been built in the area for a more affordable option. And then also there's some strata townhouses built here as well. Beautiful views down the lake and some nice floor plans. The other thing you get in Calvi that we should mention is a nice view across the lake to Kalamalka Provincial Park, which is 3,218 hectares of beautifulness. If you have a home in Calview and are looking for a house value, be sure to check out our website at calviewhomes.com. And if you're wanting info on buying in the area, be sure to download our free Greater Vernon Relocation Guide. The link is below. And be sure to watch our other video tours of the other neighborhoods in Vernon and Coldstream as well.